Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of RimWorld. So, today, we might be trying to, to, to find that Taurus and, uh, tame it. Because that'd be awesome. So on over here again. Capybaras, oh yeah, those, those things are silly. Food. Alright, and another chinchilla. I don't think chinchillas are really useful for anything other than meat, and possibly you can get their fur. But I'm not completely sure. So, our tiny little base. I might expand a little bit more into here so we have more room, because our people are definitely going to want that, and I want to make this bed somewhere else in here, because this person is going to get real sassy that these, or these people will get real sassy that this person has a big room, so let's actually designate that right now. Orders mine. Do that. And we need more flooring. Floor, middle tile. All right. Everything should go pretty decently. Slightly faster. Actually, you, I'm going to designate you to oh, I don't have a dumping spot. Architect, uh, zones and areas, we want a dumping stockpile, and we'll make that over there. Alright. Hauling chunk of slate, and that also needs to be moved too. You can, dude, you're gonna, you should, you should do that for me. Danke. Alright, so we're gonna need more food. Uh, our strawberries were close to being done, if I remember correctly. Uh, 47, did they already harvest them? Could've swore, growth rate, 100%. Okay, now that's just, oh, I was, I was misleading myself the entire time. Mm, yes. Alright. Oh, it's... eh. So we need more food. We're gonna have someone go hunting. I also need a butcher table. A butcher table... Uh, is... Can that... Do you construct that? Is that... Oh, that makes sense. So yeah, a butcher table is good for taking meat and that you found and butchering it. So, who is my best at shooting? I gave them the rifle, whoever they are. So it's going to be you, Yurden. Um, I'm actually going to have you go and... Let's hunt this cobra. Work, we may want to make it so just him can hunt, because otherwise everyone else will try to, and... Is it? Yeah. Everyone else will try to, and I don't want them to. Because that is... No. It's injured. Come on. You can do it. A little bit more. Alright. So, spoils in five days, if not refrigerated. As you can see, it's dead. It has dementia. And it had cataracts, so it's like, what's the, even the point? Body. Gunshot. Oh, I thought the body was a survival rifle. That'd be pretty silly. So, we want this to be hauled, and I don't know if this will accept meat. I think it does. No, no, no. Foods. Raw meat. Yeah, it'll accept it. So, someone should haul that over. Oh, they're moving it there. Huh. I wonder if you can even cook that. Or if you can even uh, butcher that. Well, to figure that out, we need to build a butcher table. And we're going to build that probably right there. Oh, that looks really bad. Oh, well. So let's get that butcher table up. Uh, that is under... Production steel butcher table. And that should definitely be enough. It's going to be a little cramped, but we're okay. It's not a huge deal. <laughs> I also need to build another solar panel because my power is slowly dwindling. And I like keeping that light on, and this doesn't need to be on, so someone can turn that off. I think even one of these things takes power. The butcher table, I think, takes power. Maybe it's the food. No, it's this one. It's the cook stove. That makes sense. 
So they say one of them takes unnecessary power, even though it's a stove, so I guess it should. Oh, my coffee is dwindling fastly. Oh, no. How many people? Please only be like one or two. Oops. Alright, they're probably spot up here. No. Where are they? Trying to trying to use my eye spots to, you know, actually look around for people where they're gonna spawn. It's difficult. All of a sudden, I'm just blind. There, yeah, it's Will. What's he got? Please just be melee. He's got a shiv. All right, that's that's okay. That's that's pretty decent. Not decent, but it's tolerable. Ooh, there's a good shader though. So once it's daytime, he'll probably make his assault. Actually, he'll probably start making his way here uh, through the middle of the night. And that's when he'll actually mount the assault. And I might be able to build a uh, a turret in time to help stop that. I think I have enough metal. 385, I think that's enough. <laughs> Let's go back to my people. Let's see if they're out and about. Um, where's my base? There it is. Yes, everyone is out and about. That's good. Well, actually, just Chaz. So, Chaz, I'm going to actually have you make me an improvised turret. Let's build that right there. You. Alright, Tiger's going to do that quick. Very soon, I'm going to have to designate everyone to become uh, fighters. I'm going to have to draft them. And once they're drafted, they are going to do battle. I'm going to turn this on. And we're actually going to quickly... Oh no, it's gone. Actually, that's probably the same one from last time. Well, darn it. Well, I'm going to have you uh, haul some stuff because I like that. Alright. The Pirates of the Wild Jaguars, or from the Wild Jaguars, are beginning their assault. He is very far away. That turret is just about done. Done. It has power. That's everything it needs. And he should be getting here very soon. There he is. And this is when we take all of our people who aren't melee, because he is a melee person, and we are going to draft them. Drafting is R, R, and R. Take them, move them outside. And then, when he becomes in range, we will click on him, and they will begin fighting. I don't know why Chaz is, uh, cannot fight. Oh, well then. Chaz, you are going to retreat back inside, and Tiger, I'm going to draft you and keep you inside as well. They're fighting. My dog, uh, he can't fight yet. He's only obedient to Yarden, so he'll just wander around him, and he's kind of, he might get in the way, but we'll see. They aren't doing too much, which is a little sad, but come on. Uh, didn't get him. There we go. Alright, we need to build a grave now. We'll take our people and undraft them. Uh, Chaz will probably go lay in bed because he is injured and actually needs to recuperate. Well, these people, I will undraft them, but I also need to do a miscellaneous. Get another grave. Uh, where's our grave? Right there. Build another grave there. Have you prioritized doing that? He was the only one injured. It was a little bit of a waste of metal, but it helped prevent another one of our people from being injured. So that's almost a plus. And we get a little bit of metal back from it. Uh, we lost 50, 80, I think. And do that. I'll strip you of your clothes, because we could probably use those. And take the steel ship and make that grabbable as well. We want to prioritize stripping, and then he'll bury them. 
And these clothes, uh, we can sell, they'll probably sell for absolutely garbage. But it, it's something. And something is better than nothing. I'm gonna haul all these, because they are just getting in the way now. Chaz is sleeping in his bed. That is good. We need more floors for our house. And do. We also need a door. Which will be under structure. I'm still getting used to the layout of this, even though I play with a lot. Oh well. And we have that butcher table. So what we want to do is we want to make a bill. Bill of butcher creature. And there is a distance that it will do it, so let's change the settings and ingredient radius 999. That is the highest it goes to, I believe and it will butcher animal corpses. It will butcher all of these different corpses. Kind of brutal, you say corpse, but yes. I assume one of those is the, was it a cobra? Uh, cobra. So it should butcher it and it should give us a meat, which then we can turn into meals, which I believe we have three more meals. Someone will butcher that, there goes tiger. Ooh, a combat supplier. I will definitely check them out. So we got 17 Cobra Flesh and 3 Cobra Skin. We can sell the Cobra Skin or we might be able to use it to make something. And this person will take... Oh, are we going to take the meat? Yep. Uh, Chaz is taking the meat and he is making a meal. And there he goes. Sweet. Now we have uh, one meal. One meal for a hunt. Uh, we are running out of food again. But we will soon have more. Hopefully this combat supplier will have something more than just guns. And we'll hopefully be able to sell our stuff to that combat supplier as well. Chaz, I'm actually going to have you call that combat supplier real quick. So, all they have is medicine, artillery shells, uh, some melee weapons, and a bunch of guns. Who would I guess? So they will take the shiv and they will take our medicine. We're going to sell that shiv just because we don't need it. Because it is garbage. And we will look at everything else that they have. Some grenades, helmets. What is this? A bundle of spears, non-reusable. Okay. Shotgun. Minigun. Hmm. <laughs> Your wait, is that a single spear? Eight thousand dollars. Ooh boy, that's expensive. Okay. Uh nothing is really in our price range of um two hundred wait, is that how much we have? No, that's items. We have 676. So, yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's, that makes sense. So, we don't want to do anything, really, because uh, everything's extremely expensive. I might buy... Buy six med kits because med kits will be very helpful. Oh, I just sold med kits. Hmm. Chaz, I need your uh, assistance again. Oh, uh, I accidentally. <laughs> My bad. So we'll have to buy them at a premium, but that is fine. We'll take those back, and we'll buy yours for your freaking super expensive. So, sorry about that. I had, a little, I had a little moment, a little Dan moment there. Oh, Chaz, go, go to your bed. Oh, he's, he's stargazing. Okay, he can do what he wants. Also, this should probably be powered off, and this should be powered off too. Or sleep. That works too, I guess. And before the next day. Oh, that is a tile. That is not something that can hold. Alright. Getting that one meal, we need someone to hunt again, because we need food. Is there any food within the radius around us? 58% growth. That's not that great. There is no food very close. This is, this is a little sad. I don't really want to hunt those. Those are a little bit far away and uh, scary looking. Boomalopes? Uh, so we're gonna hunt some more cobras. We will hunt that cobra. And that cobra. 
think that's all the cobras. And why not that chinchilla as well? Everyone is doing their stuff. Lights are off. Power should be going up. And since we have a little bit of metal left, we should build a second solar generator. Oh, that probably makes sense. As you see, uh, it exploded and cut it off, cut us off, preventing us from having more power. We will build that right over here because it'll look a little bad, but it'll be fine for now. He's hunting that, and right when it's done, I want to make sure he's going to pick it up. All right, so he's picking that up. We'll also hunt this boar. Sweet, that was... He's doing a pretty good job. Some of those are hidden. Boars definitely take extra work to hunt. Oh, They're stronger. It is... Ooh, it is downed. He's going to have to finish it off. It's in shock. Is he going to do it? Combat supplier and visitors. We don't need the combat suppliers. That's probably from last time. Visitors, it's fine. So now we have both of these, let's hook up our solar generator, like so, that should do it. Yes, we are now on the grid again, this should be going up, sure is, and, oh, the tortoise is over here, quick tame on the tortoise, and have that go. It appears that there wasn't any super uh, profitable hunts today. Chinchilla was hunted, boar is still alive, tortoise failed the 5% chance. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, he's finishing off the boar, close range. It's taking him a while. He's a pretty bad shot. Yeah. Poor boar. He's like, just kill me. Just, just kill me! Is he going to sleep? He's just gonna wait till morning to do it! What a guy! Man, kinda wanna box that tortoise in. Let's see if I can do that. Um, uh, structure, steel wall. Come on, people. Do it. Do it. Wake up. Come on, Jazz. Jazz. You can do it. Come on. Is he stuck? Is the torch stuck? Yes! Awesome! Um. Animal interacted too recently, so we can't let the tortoise do anything, but we're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna build a little area for him. So, uh, why can I not build wood? Is wood in research? Wood is not in there? Uh, huh. cabinets. Why is there no wood? What is wood good for except for flooring? I was very sure you could build with wood last time. Wood walls, they just started on fire a lot easier. Hmm. I'm probably looking something over. Alright. Well, he is now hunting that cobra from extremely far away and this boar has bled out and finally died so we'll make that uh, grabbable and I believe there should be some more meals unless they were eaten the meat should be butchered there's the cobra flesh we'll set this to just a bunch of meals so we don't have to really look at it and we'll set this to be a bunch of butchered stuff. 
and I should probably make some nutrient paste, a nutrient paste dispenser, just because our people. Uh, actually, wait, no. You don't even have anything to put in there. That's not good. Our strawberries should be very close. Seventy-one percent. Oh, people can starve a little bit longer, probably. Needs food. Yeah, their food's going down. They're a little salty. But they're going to have to deal with it for now because I did not really think of food and hunting is a thing. I also might start hunting capybaras because there's a bunch of capybaras. Is he okay? Is he okay? His stuff's going down. We'll build him a little bit bigger of a room. Uh, we'll also get rid of... Something like that will be fine. It's a steel door, hopefully. I'm out of metal. Hmm. Oh, someone's gonna have to deal with that. There's one meal. No one's taken it yet. We got this. We got this. We'll be fine. Hopefully tomorrow... Oh, those won't be done by tomorrow. That's definitely for sure. Well, that's it for this episode. We'll hopefully get some more food. Maybe do a little bit more hunting if that pack of uh, wild uh, creatures comes back. And why is that? I was just injured. No need metal. There's just a monkey. There's just a monkey over there. So that ends it for this episode. I hope everyone enjoyed, and... Please watch the next episode. Have a great day, guys. Bye.